In a shark cut project, suppose we need to export only this part of the timeline. The first thing to do is to make sure the project is saved. Then go to the timeline menu and click on copy timeline to source. Notice that when you do, the viewer will switch from the project tab to the source tab. Go to the viewer's timeline and click on the position that will be the start point of the export. Now, press the I key on your keyboard to set the input frame. Back to the viewer's timeline, select the position that will be the end point of the export. Press the O key on your keyboard to set the output frame. Open the export tab. The from menu should be automatically set to source. Click the export button. Give a name to the file. And click save to start exporting the clip. I hope this video was useful to you. Feel free to use the comment section if you have questions or to give your impressions about the tutorial. Thank you for watching.